Welcome! Today we're going to talk about irony and what that means. And as you can see here, it's when the intended meaning is the exact opposite of the literal meaning. It's also written above right here on the board in case you forget as we're going through this. Um, make sure to take notes because these will help you when we're analyzing text later on. You will need these notes and you'll be graded on them tomorrow. So. Irony, um, again, it's when the intended meaning is the exact opposite of the literal meaning. Um, intended meaning was supposed to happen. Literal meaning is what actually happened, like literally. Um, so for instance here, we have this really cute little chicky. Um, he's like, Jimmy, answer me, please. He's a, and he's a sunny side up egg there. Um, so we have some questions here, which you'll practice these as well. Um, what's the intended meaning? What's the literal meaning? And how is it ironic? Is it ironic or not? Um, so intended meaning, his brother was cooked. Literal meaning, his brother was cooked. Ironic, not so much. Here we go. We have uh, this overweight man here um, wearing an IB anorexia t-shirt. Um, intended meaning is I survived anorexia, which is an eating disorder for those of you who don't know, um, where you're really skinny, don't eat anything. Literal happening is I'm dying from obesity. And is it ironic? Yes, it is because it's funny. And obviously he did beat anorexia. Um, so here are a few that you all are going to try on your own. What is the intended meaning? What is the literal meaning? And is it ironic? Yes or no. So you're going to fill this out on the chart and the picture should match. Here's another one. Um, what's the intended meaning? What's the literal meaning? And is it ironic? Poor Darren. Only once in life is a drama-free relationship. Um... I'll be dead soon, snowman. What's the intended meaning? What's the literal meaning? And is it ironic, yes or no? Again, <laughs> as you can see, this truck has some awesome flames on it, like right there. Um, intended meaning, what's the literal meaning? Or what's the literal happening? And is it ironic, yes or no? Again, here's another one. It's a medieval knight using a cell phone. What is the intended meaning? What's the literal happening, and is it ironic, yes or no? So now that you've kind of practiced with irony, let's talk about the different types of irony. There's verbal, dramatic, and situational. Some of you are really proficient at verbal irony, and you don't even know it. Um, so types of irony, verbal. Um, we have this cute little comic here. I'm sure your dog loves his vegan diet. Get it? Because vegans, vegetarians, dogs like meat. Um, literal words are the opposite of the intended meaning. Example, don't be nervous. It's only the most important test of your life. Smiley face. Uh, this is also known as sarcasm is another version of this. Um, here's dramatic irony. This is the Jaws poster. Um, what the character thinks is the opposite of what the reader knows. So we know she's about to get eaten by a shark. Um, but the character obviously does not. This is the same with horror movies when we know the really scary guy is hiding right behind them or in their closet. We're like, no, don't go upstairs. That is dramatic irony because we know something that they don't. So example, a boy tells his mother he is late because he was at a friend's house. The audience know that the mother talked to the friend's mother and knows the son was not there. That's a bummer for him. You should always, you should always tell the truth. Um, situational irony. Uh, this 24-hour fitness with a lovely escalator. Um, an event or situation is the opposite of expectations. Um, if you're going to go work out, you should use the stairs. Just throwing it out there. Um, example, a mouse chasing a cat would be an example of situational irony. So... Now, on your worksheet, you are going to categorize this type, these types of irony and explain what type of irony it is. Why? So we have a Pepsi truck here and a Coca-Cola 
machine. Um, we have this one, irony. That's just the way it is. Um, it's freedom. I don't know if you can see that. It's like right at the bottom of the statue at his feet and it says freedom really big, but yeah, what's around him? Um, childhood obesity. Don't take it lightly with a lovely McDonald's ad right below it. My kind of shopping spree. McDonald's. All right. Um, I think this is the last one. Man, I hate when that happens. Think we'll ever get rescued, Hank? Don't know, Earl. Man, if only a ship would come by. Yeah, wouldn't that be great? Want to talk about <laughs> favorite foods again? Nah, too depressing. And if you notice, the little ship is slowly sailing by. Awesome. Well, get those sheets done. That's your homework. And make sure you have the different types of irony defined in your composition notebook. And we'll be checked tomorrow.